I'm Cheyenne. Corbin and I met in college about five years ago when we pledged the same fraternity. And the first time I heard him speak, I thought, yeah, we're not going to get along. But as I watched him mature, I realized that determination and courage were his strongest qualities and that he was someone that I should be looking up to. I see two people in the most loving and trustworthy relationship that most people dream for. I love you guys. So Randy, it's your endless love that made him into a better person. single moment of our lives together. I like to think that some of my values and ethics and virtues that are instilled in you are good. <laughs> and you'll carry those along. Oh, I love you so much. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I got all that. Everyone's like, you're so chill. <laughs> Watching you grow to the woman that you are right here today has been the biggest honor of my life. Corbin and Randy. You're not entering into a legal contract but a spiritual covenant to join together and to love each other with a love that goes beyond our human understanding and feelings. Do you take Randy to be your wife? To love her as Christ has loved you already? Loved you to honor her from this day forward? I do. Randy, do you take Corbin to be your husband, to love him, to encourage him, and to be one with him from this day forward? I pledge this love to you forever. I pledge this love to you forever. And take you to be my husband. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, I pronounce you husband and wife. Corbin, you may kiss your bride. Proud of you, baby. I love you. You're my freaking wife. <laughs> and you, and you are so damn gorgeous. And I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you, baby. Cheers.
Thank you.